Kathy would never inform me of anything like a meeting or whatever, um, which is the mistake with this, um, this article which appeared in the French newspaper. Um, and this journalist said that I had warned Kathy not to attend the meeting. I mean, I knew about no meeting, so I couldn't warn him. Um, what I ha had said was, I had a sort of dark premonition about this place, Ravonia. Um, it wasn't specific, it wasn't tied to anything, it wasn't even tied to that they would get arrested there. I just hated the place. Um, and as I say, it was a sort of premonition that something horrible was going to happen there, and that was all. I knew nothing about meetings, I knew nothing about. The only person I'd met there was uh, two people actually. One was Walter Sisulu, who came to greet me in, at the car. I didn't get out of the car, I always stayed in the car. And the gardener there. Kathy introduced me to the gardener. His name was David. Uh, he, uh, he appeared in the Ravonia trial. I, I've forgotten his surname, I'm afraid. Molozzi. Hmm? It's either Molozzi or Moloi. Yeah, I think Molozzi. Um, he, he was introduced to me because there was um, a... There had been a decision right at the end that I was to be involved more closely with the courier service at Travonia. And I don't know whether I mentioned, um, uh, Kathy told me that I would work together with Winnie Mandela and, and um, Adelaide Joseph. Um, and, and I had said, I actually said to him, I'm not going to do it. Uh, Why? I, uh, and Kathy said, you're a coward. I said, I'm not a coward. Um, I think the security here is very bad, and I'm not prepared to get involved in it. And um, Kathy said, yes, we're moving from here. This place is known to too many people. We are moving. We've already taken a decision to move from here, and it was to happen evidently in a day or two after that. And um, he mentions it in his memoirs, and he said the problem was that last meeting should never have taken place at Travonia.